Howdy folks, my name is Stanley 111 and welcome to the Fallout Armory. Today we're going to be looking at the melee weapon, the Rebar Club. This crude weapon is a piece of concrete with three pieces of rebar sticking out of it. In addition, the bottom of the three rebars appears to be wound together by a strip of brown leather or cloth to make a handle. This weapon has a special mauler attack that does regular damage in VATS at the cost of 8 more action points, but it does have a very high chance to knock down enemies. This attack requires a melee weapons skill of 50 though. The rebar club can successfully strike about 1245 times from full condition before breaking. The club requires a strength of 9 and a melee weapon skill of 50 for it to be at its maximum potential. It can damage from 38 to 44 depending on the condition it is in. The rebar club has a weight of 9 pounds and it is valued roughly at about 500 caps. There is a unique variant called the Nuka Breaker, which is referencing the very well executed web series Fallout Nuka Break, which I personally love to bits. But this weapon is in the Gunrunner's arsenal, so I will cover it later once I get onto the DLC weapons. I love the Rebar Club and I suggest you use it as an early on melee weapon, which is a fairly high damage per hit. I even use it against some of the tougher enemies later on. Sorry for it being a shorter episode, but remember to tell me what weapon you want me to cover next. Thank you very much for watching Fallout Armory. Make sure to drop a like, drop a comment, and subscribe if you've not done so already. My name is Stanley Wonderland. See you guys next time.